We begin tonight with our top local story, Chief Resigning. Providence Police Chief Colonel Dean Esserman is calling it quits after eight and a half years as head of the department. It's my decision. The decision is that it's time for me to resign from this police department. Colonel Esserman's decision to resign comes amid controversy over underage drinking at a graduation party for his daughter at their home earlier this month. He says the incident has become too much of a distraction to him, the city, the police department, and his family. Eyewitness News reporter Katherine Sotnik is outside Providence Public Safety Complex with our top local story tonight. Well, Colonel Dean Esterman says he did wrestle with his decision for some time, but he says it was the appropriate and the right thing to do. He says he was not forced out of the Providence Police. The announcement came late Wednesday afternoon. Colonel Dean Esterman is resigning as Providence Police Chief. So for more than eight years, it has been a privilege to serve as the police chief of this city. But this has become a distraction. Distraction in my home. Distraction for me, distraction in this police department. I accepted it. It was his decision, and we're going to move on. Word did spread fast among rank and file during shift change. Many of the officers telling me they didn't really think this was coming, but that it didn't come as a shock either. Esserman says the latest scandal, an underage drinking party at his east side home, was the main motivator for his resignation. I didn't do anything illegal. I'm clear about that. But I've got to take responsibility for what happened in my home. I'm not going to parent in public. I'm going to parent only in private. And this wasn't the first scandal in Esserman's eight-year tenure. Earlier this year, he was suspended for a day after a verbal altercation with another officer. And last year, the department was rocked by the Operation Deception drug scandal. And prior to that, the police union voted no confidence in him. This agency in the Providence Police is bigger than any individual. And... Um, he is a person that's led, is respected, and decided to move on. And we've learned that Colonel Esterman's last day here in Providence is at the end of the month. Reporting from the Providence Mobile Newsroom, I'm Katherine Sotnik, Eyewitness News.